Hello, I'd like to talk to you today about Rio's Elite Tarpon Line. This is a tarpon line for the tarpon angler. This is Rio's Elite Tarpon Line, and that means it's our best tarpon line we've ever made. What makes it the best is the fact that it has two things. One, it has direct core. Direct core is a low stretch core material for tropical lines, so it's stiff, which is great in the heat, but it doesn't have a lot of stretch. You can see here, it's just kind of low stretch. And that low stretch is good for a couple of things. It's good for high line speed when you're casting, which is obviously awesome for penetrating into a wind. It's also very, very good for when you're doing a strip set, which you always want to do with a tarpon, or when you're fighting a big tarpon, right? The fish is pulling or you want to pull. In both those situations, the last thing you want is a core that's stretchy, a normal fly fishing core, because you have no effect. It's hard to strip set and it's hard to pull a fish because your core is stretching. So that low stretch direct core is awesome for setting the hook and keeping the fish on and playing it. The other thing that's really cool about the Elite version is it has slick cast coating. Super low friction coating. In fact, it's the lowest friction ever measured in a fly line. And that means it shoots well, it shoots far, it shoots easily, and the coating migrates through the surface and it's always refreshing itself. It doesn't rub off or it doesn't dis disappear. It's always going to stay slick. It's an awesome, awesome coating. That's our slick cast coating. Now the head of this line is about 40 foot long. So it's a fairly short head, but that's awesome because it loads up quickly. Right? You're up there, you're about to make the shot. The last thing you want is to take six or seven casts to get your line out there. So a fairly short head, front loaded is perfect for that situation. That's what this taper is. That front loading is also good for casting your typical tarpon flies. Right? They're not generally heavy, but they're air resistant. And if you're new to tarpon fishing, you will find them hard to cast because they're, they're thick and fluffy and there's a lot of air resistance. So if you have a fly line with weight at the front, that makes that quite a bit easier to turn over your typical tarpon flies and your longer tarpon leaders that you tend to fish. The line itself is this carefully thought out color scheme. The front end is what we call seagrass in color. And that's a great color, it's not bright top and swim under it, which they sometimes do. They don't bolt away because the color's visible and bright and popping. But behind that section, there's this orange section, and this orange section is your sighter. And frequently you're fishing for tarpon over seagrass and turtle grass and, and just weed that's a kind of a similar color to this front end. It's kind of hard for you to spot that line against that background because they're a similar color. And so behind this front section, we have this orange visible bit, and that's your your sighter. That gives you an indication of the direction you're casting when you can't see the front of your line and as, as well as kind of your distance you're casting. And then behind that orange section is this sand color, just like a regular sand color running line. And that those three color schemes all together, that's what we call surefire. That's a, a surefire coating. And that's it. That's our tarpon line. So look out for it. This is the Rio's Elite Tarpon Line and you can find that from your local fly shop or you can get that online. Rio, make the connection.